Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Katherine Vargas and today we are going to be doing a Sephora haul. But before I jump right into that haul, if you do love hauls, make sure to check out my last video. I also did a Sephora haul as well as a Ulta haul. So I'm just going to leave one up here as well as leave both of them down in my description bar. And let's just jump into this video guys because I got so much stuff so I'm not going to make this video long for you guys. So before I do so, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know that you guys love these type of videos and I'll just continue to do them for you. And yeah, let's get into this haul. All right guys, so I'm not gonna go in any order. I just have the bag right here and I'm just gonna grab and just see what they are. So the first thing I got is the Olaplex number no. seven bonding oil. So one of the reasons I got this right here is because I am going to be dyeing my hair today actually um, black. So like, I don't know if you guys can notice but my roots are coming back. I do have brown hair. So I am going to be re it black and I was just looking at some of like their products. I do have the number zero and I just happened to be browsing and I had one of the workers literally come up to me and was like, girl, this is the one. If you're going to get any of the products, get this one. So I was like, okay. So I went ahead and got that up. It's a bonding oil. It just boosts shine, strengthens and repairs all hair types. So I was like, perfect because I'm going to need that after tonight. And this also um, works as a like heat protectant, like right before you're gonna like blow dry or like straighten your hair as well. So that's gonna be perfect for tonight. Then I got the Soft Pinch Blush by Rare Beauty in the shade Love. So I did go ahead and pick up another one of this. I do have the shade Bliss and I absolutely love it. It's what I'm wearing on my cheeks right now on top i'll just put like a little bit of a topper on top of that but i absolutely love the blush shade it's basically to me this is the best liquid blush that i've ever tried hands down so i wanted to go ahead and pick up their other shades there was another shade that i wanted i think it was joy but it was sold out and it's been sold out for like basically the month of december at like the sephora that i go to i don't know why they haven't been like restocking or anything so the next shade I picked was Love. And to be honest, I was kind of scared to pick this one up because this one's more on the ready side. So it has like that beautiful like red undertone to it. And I've never wore a bl I never wore a blush, my apologies, this color or this shade. So I'm kind of like a little bit scared to try it out. But like I said, I really love her formula. And I decided to go ahead and just pick this one up because everything else was kind of sold out. So I'm just going to go ahead and give you guys a mini swatch of how it looks. So this is what it looks like blended out. Just a smidge, not like fully. But like I said, it's definitely on the ready, orangey, darker side. So I guess we shall see how this one works for me. So another thing that I got was the Beauty Blenders Besties Limited Edition Starting Set. So this is just a starting set that comes with a pouch, the sponge, the cleaner, and a little like basically scrub -a mat So this is what it looks like right here. And this is what it looks like. Like I said, it comes with the pouch. Inside is the Beauty sponge then the soap and then the mat that's in there as well and i've never used the beauty blender before obviously i used like beauty sponges but i never like used the original beauty blender so i wanted to go ahead and just test it out see if i like it this was only like 20 dollars as well so and i think i have like a 10 dollars off sephora so it only cost me about 10 dollars for this then the next thing I got was another thing that I got because like I said I am dyeing my hair tonight. 
So I went into Sephora and I was just looking around and I saw this and I know I've seen this a lot on other people's Sephora hauls. So like I said, it was like kind of hyped and I wanted to see if I liked it myself. So I got this Brigio Mary Molting Masking. It only costs 36 bucks and it comes with a three hair mask. This is something that I've been missing. I don't have a lot of hair masks and this is the first time that I've heard about this brand. So I went ahead and did a little bit of research and it looked like the ratings were like off the charts. So it just comes, I believe, with the three like best sellers. Cause I know when I was talking to the guy, he was like definitely recommending me this one right here. So I went ahead and picked this up. Like I said, I'm gonna use it tonight, see if I like it. And for the price, I thought it was very inexpensive for like what you got. So I went ahead and picked that up. Then I also picked up another hair mask and this one, oh my God, I cannot even pronounce the name, is, oh my God, Yua Kua, right here. <laughs> So this is what it's called, this one's a treatment mask and this is another brand that I did like a little bit of research on and almost everything was literally like 5 stars so this was on sale and then they had also anything that was on sale they got an additional 20% off so I decided to go ahead and pick this up, see if I like it and I think it was also inexpensive, like I think it cost like 20 bucks or even less than that for this. In this haul, I've really been focusing on hair care because um, if you saw my last haul, I really focused more on the makeup. But here, I decided to focus a little bit more on hair because my hair needs it, guys. I just want to have beautiful hair, but that's like impossible for me. I don't know what to do. <laughs> now, the next thing I got is this lip set that i also got because they had an additional 20 percent off on sale and it is the smash box gloss angelus trio so it just comes with three full size lip glosses and it's so cute i love the packaging of it i forgot how to open this oh right here so this is the three lip glosses right here and this one is so perfect because like this one's like the perfect one that when you just want like a clear gloss like for example if you just put lip liner and you just want like a clear gloss to go over it nothing with color this one is perfect so this one's really the one that sold me that I was like mm, maybe I'll just get it like I said it was like 11 bucks and then 20% off and then I really do like the color of this one this one is so unique though I hope it picks it up on the camera but it actually has like little specks of like purple in it. But yeah, I decided to pick that up because you can never have too many lip glosses. Then another lip gloss that I got, well actually this one was one that my boyfriend got me. It is the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Gloss Balm Creams. So these are just the new gloss bombs that she just came out with. And then when they were doing like the promotion i guess on like instagram if you follow fancy beauty she was just showing the lip colors and i literally fell in love with the shade honey waffles it is the perfect nudie brown so i was just telling my boyfriend about it and i was like buy it for me and he's like sure so <laughs> so he went ahead and picked that up for me and let me show you guys that color like it's literally the perfect nudie brown this is gonna look beautiful under a lip liner over like a matte liquid lip anything so i went ahead and grabbed this shade because oh my god i'm actually gonna put some down mm, it smells so good so pretty what do you think i went ahead and put a, a lip gloss over it that was like pinky base but i think this one just made it like orangey base i actually like this way more but yeah this is another thing that i picked up then i did pick up one skincare product and it is this set so this is the set right here and this comes with a skin mist the water sleeping mask a moisturizer and then the lip sleeping mask 
So I thought you definitely get a good deal. So this is only $39. Um, this was another thing that was on sale and then it had a 20% off. So I think it was like, I can't even remember. I think it was like $20 for this kit. And I already have this one, like the full size of it, but this is so perfect. So I'm just gonna go ahead, put this in my like wallet, purse, anything and just keep it with me because I don't mind losing this one, but my original big one, I just keep it on my desk or on my table because I do um, wear that every single night before I go to sleep. So this one's definitely gonna be just um, kept on me. Then I'm definitely excited to try the mist. And then we just got a sleeping mask as well that I'm gonna try to incorporate for my nighttime routine and then a moisturizer so like i said i wanted to go ahead and test this out and it was just like inexpensive so i said why not i've been loving this brand lately i've been getting some of their stuff and i've been loving it so i wanted to go ahead and just test this one out as well then i went ahead and picked up a blowout spray so this one's the amica brooklyn bombshell and this is just something that you put like before you blow dry your hair. So um, like I said, I've been focusing on hair care. So I went ahead and picked this up. Then another thing that I picked up was the Tarte Creaseless Concealer. I did pick this up in the shade Light Sand. And this is the one that came with the Minis Lights Camera Lashes Tarte Mascara. So this is it right here. I'm a fan of full coverage concealer so this is the one thing that kind of attracted me to this and I wanted to go ahead and test it out I've been um testing out concealers lately to see which one I like so I went ahead and just added this one to the pile just to see if I like it then lastly this is the last thing that I got and it is the Amica kit so this is what it looks like right here. It comes with a dry shampoo and mask and then a moisture and shine cream. I only really bought this for the dry shampoo because I've been needing one desperately, but like a good one. So I went ahead and picked up this one. I'm very particular when it comes to dry shampoos. I have tried like the Dove ones, the Batiste ones, um, I think even the Pantene ones and I know I don't like them when I just forget about them and stop using it. So I went ahead and picked up this one. I do like the smell of it. I've used this like once or twice and I do like how it's performing. The mask and um, the shine I really don't care for. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and give that away to my sister or something. Because I do have other better masks I guess. But um, I did buy this for the dry shampoo and like I said, I've been liking it lately. So uh, that is the end of my Sephora haul. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know what was your favorite thing from this haul or what's like one thing that you got from this haul that you tried and I haven't. And just let me know what you guys think about it. Like what do you guys think about the mask? What do you guys think about the like Olaplex? Do you like it or if you don't, should I be returning some of this stuff? Let me know down below. And I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.